CostX helps you efficiently break down the work, costs, and products in your projects into manageable components and automatically summarize them from branch to trunk. CostX is used to create WBS, CBS, and PBS, and thanks to its powerful customization features, you will find many more possibilities. With this introductory course, you can create documents this efficiently and change their content this efficiently. Let's us start from the beginning. Click the plus icon to create and open a new document. CostX is a document-based application, and you specify the location of the document when you save it. Select a tree node and click the plus button in the right corner to add a child node, and the newly added child node will be selected. If you press the shift key while clicking the plus button, the original selection will not be changed after adding the new node. Change the properties of the node in the inspectors and you will see that the entered data is automatically summarized upwards in the tree structure. Click the toggle view button on the toolbar to switch to columns view. The display in columns view is similar to the display in the finder apps columns view. Click the Add button in the Node Group control bar to add a child node to the corresponding node group, or select a node and use the menu to add a child node or sibling node. In the List view, you can continuously add new nodes to the end of the list. The new node has the same hierarchy as the previous one. If you insert a space before the name, you can customize the node hierarchy. If you insert a backslash character in front of the name, the new node is at the highest outline level. You can also add new nodes via the application menu, the context menu, and of course via the corresponding keyboard shortcuts. Drag a node in the same window to move it. If you press the option key while dragging, the node will be copied to the children of the destination node. The columns view also supports drag and drop operations. You can also copy nodes between multiple windows by dragging and dropping them. You can copy nodes within a window and between multiple windows by using the copy and paste operation. To copy the entire node in the list view, select the WBS cell of a node. If other cells are selected, the copy and paste operation is applied to those cells. In list view, you can freely switch focus between cells by clicking the mouse or using the arrow keys. Clicking on a selected cell or pressing the enter key starts the change, and pressing the escape or enter key ends the edit. You can also change the contents of a cell by copying and pasting, both within the same window and between different windows. If you have set up the use of the photo field in the document, you can change the photo of the node by dragging and dropping. You can drag images from files, the photos application, the web browser, to the CostX node to make changes. The foregoing is only a description of the basic features of CostX. CostX also provides very powerful features that allow you to create and modify documents very efficiently. Some of the following demonstrations will be very useful for you. The first demonstrates how to copy multiple lines of text to create an entire tree structure in one step. The second shows how to copy content from Excel to change multiple cells in a list view at once. And the last demonstrates how to drag and drop an entire document to copy all the nodes, 
a method you may find handy for gathering summary information from your team. We recommend you take a look at the online documentation for more details. There you'll find more great ways to make your work more efficient. CostX not only offers powerful maintenance features, but also a wealth of user interface customization features to tailor it to your needs as much as possible. You can use the examples included in the application as a guide, such as the work breakdown, the cost breakdown, and the product breakdown with a simple bill of materials. Some examples go beyond the main design goals, such as a company's salary schedule, simple annual budgets for individuals, wedding budgets, and actual expenses. CostX provides more than 50 fields for entering cost data, strings, dates, etc. With CostX you can choose which fields to use and display for a document, change the display titles of these fields, and the order in which they are displayed. You can also customize how the nodes are displayed in chart and columns views. Below we show you how to set up an ordinary WBS document. Fields entered and displayed in this document include WBS number, work item name, cost, and comments. Costs are divided into estimated and actual groups and include labor, material, and total costs, with labor calculated using labor hours and labor rates. To simplify this demo, additional fields have been added for the photo, work item start and end dates, and completion rate. Click the file name button on the toolbar to set up the document, including basic attributes such as currency and category. Click the fields display button to select the desired fields. And change the display title of the corresponding fields. Click the Fields Order button, drag fields up or down to change their display order. You can also specify how you want the nodes to be displayed, either in the chart view or in the columns view. CostX supports export of CSV files and provides options to select what to include in the output. More import and export features will be available in future versions. Your feedback on improvements to the app is very helpful and your ideas are welcome. We encourage you to take a look at the online documentation. You will find that your efficiency will improve significantly.